All right, Miguel's getting into his new endeavor. He's got one of these plastic boxes ready. He's going to get into raising mealworms. He has his wheat bread. It's been in the freezer for 48 hours. The old cornmeal been in the freezer for 48 hours. And old-fashioned rolled oats. And uh, the mealworms are coming from the post office. We have a friend that's picking them up. Are you excited to get started, Miguel? Yeah, um, I get excited every time I, I try something new. This is another thing that's new for me, but you can never say you you know how to do it, you never try. Or you can't tell people, I can't do that if you didn't try. Yeah. All right, so when the mealworms get here, we'll show you as they go in. Got them opened up. It's supposed to be 2,000 worms. Looks pretty gross to me, but that's what chickens like. So let's get them in their container. They put a little bag of wheat bran in there, but we already ordered some. And I'm going to put it in two separate drawers and divide the mealworms up between two drawers. That's the first drawer. And as you can see, they are very much alive. And the second drawer. Pick up the papers in there. Just leave the papers in there for a little bit. I don't have a chance to crawl off. We got some apples cut up and some carrots. We're going to put that in the two drawers for the water source. For the mealworms. Got the apples and carrots placed in there for the water source. In the bottom drawer. And some in the upper drawer. We'll be back to see if they're taking in water. All right, guys. Um, we're going to show you our mealworm that we just started. You see on last time, we put carrots and apples. And I don't know if you can see on this end. is. Let a one that totally bear the carrots. You probably see a few pieces right there. The reason we put uh, carrots and apples because they can get all the water and uh, everything they need from the uh, apples and carrots. And we do the same thing down here. Put apples and carrots in there. Totally. It's usually one down here. It's not down here. But... Uh, yeah, I hope you enjoy watching our videos and I hope I encourage anyone try something different because this is something that we plan to do for a while and we finally get every time together to do it and they are going to help us feed our chickens, our rabbits, quail and, quail and fish. Thanks for watching. God bless everyone. You guys keep us in your prayers, and I hope to see you in the next video. Bye.